people welcome back to the YouTube so we're going for day in life today um, fairly standard as they go so we pull on the carts today for training um, I will probably not cover the whole thing but we will definitely get a couple of clips in there just back from cardio so 15 minutes of cardio boxed off uh, daily abs as well um, so I'm going to shower and eat it's eight o'clock on the button right now so I'm going to shower and do a couple of bits. So I'll probably pick this back up just before I go and train or probably when I get pre-workout meal in. Um, but other than that, day is fairly standard. Um, like I said, pull on the cards, then we'll just basically have meals and steps. But I'm going to the cinema later on, actually, funny enough. Um, we're going to see a thriller. I don't think it's a horror, I'm pretty sure it's a thriller. Something about crawdads. I can't remember the full name, but I'll figure it out. But yeah, so day in the life, enjoy all that stuff, like, comment, subscribe, share, um, and yeah, we'll pick it up at pre-workout. Right, what's the story people, we're back, pre-workout, ooh, ooh, can't really get myself, I'm not good at this, I'm trying, I'm trying, right, I'm in the shop. Pre-workout going in, so we're going to train in about an hour, it's 20 past 11 now, so I'm going to have Pre, uh, we'll head down to Ryan's and then we will walk to the gym. So it'll probably be about 20 past 12, half 12 by the time we get there. I keep looking at myself on the screen to make sure I'm in the shop. Um, so Pre is going in, so I will show you exactly what that is. So, current only carb source of a training day, or in fact any day. Um, so we have 50 grams of cream of rice, uh, JP, salted caramel, 100 grams of blueberries, and I also have. 40 grams of Perform Cookies and Cream Whey in there as well, and then we have 10 grams of dark chocolate to go with it. Is that, oh, I thought there was paper or something in my fucking cream rice. Does it look like there is, like, there, it's the reflection. Anyway, and then Intra, so Intra at the minute, I'm, and my hands are so shaky. Don't go clan hands, man. Um, so Intra at the minute is 15 grams of Essential Max from Strom. That is 10 grams of glutamine and five grams of creatine. So that is the standard intro workout. And then I have two grams of pink salt in there as well. So that is the current go-to intro workout. But that is that. So I'm gonna eat this um, then, oh, pre actually. So we'll go through pre and choice as well. We'll drink pre-workout afterwards. So the current stack, Stimmy Max, Vasky Max, one scoop each. Very, very nice combo, to be fair. Um, definitely need the caffeine at the minute. Dial in, still undefeated, I will say that. Um, it's actually not in stock anywhere at the minute. So that's a bit of a kick in the balls because it's like my go-to leg day pre. But we will make do, we will make do. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this. Um, we'll head down and I will catch up in the gym. So, in for pull, oh my head's not even in the picture, in for pull with some pop up work at the start, so calves first, doctor, flying ham, and then we're into pull, so single arm lat, pull down, 
T bar roll, single arm roll, upper back roll, upper back pull down, short curl, long curl, bicep work. I probably won't do a whole lot of talking here, and um, I'll just keep a couple of clips here and there because it is a day in the life at the end of the day, and we'll do uh, probably a walkthrough for a different video. But yeah, get into it. gym pull finished wrapped up won't lie it did an absolute fucking number on me i'm smoked now after that so we're going to get post workout in it's currently in the freezer 
So a post workout with a minute is 40 grams of frozen whey. It's nice though, it's a bit like eating ice cream. Um, I do cookies and cream or sometimes double chocolate, both perform, perform flavors unmatched. Um, so I'll do that. A small bit of work to do. Uh, will most likely hit a nap to be honest with you because I am just raw off. The one thing I'm noticing about training, especially the last couple of days, obviously food being so low, you know, drugs aside, it's kind of having its 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 run its course now in the initial little bump that I got um, in terms of just energy. Um, but things are definitely starting to fade fast, just my overall energy availability towards the, the kind of mid to tail end of the sessions. You know, obviously depending on, on what I'm training, pull being quite a demanding session anyway. Um, you know, saw myself fade pretty quickly, even the likes of some bicep work at the end, which I didn't record. I would have recorded right up until the upper back work, so the upper back row, upper back pull down. We literally just took one set of each there as opposed to top set back off because I was just absolutely fucked. Um, and it's, you know, I suppose you kind of have to not be a complete dickhead at times as well. That probably would have just sent me into oblivion now, to be honest, um, and I would have been raw off for the whole night. So I'm going to eat post-workout, do a little bit of work once I calm down a bit because, you know, trying to actually have that that mental capacity to sit at the laptop post-training take can take me anywhere from an hour to two hours post-training to actually have the ability to do that. So I might actually hit a nap first, just to freshen things up a little bit. Um, but other than that, not a whole lot else going on during the day. As I said, we are going to the cinema later on. In the cinema, I'm just gonna bring more frozen whey with me. So that'll be another 40 grams of whey. Yes, another 40 grams of whey. Um, I would bring that to the cinema with me. Um, but yeah, so that is that for the time being. I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna chill out for a little bit, have a nap, do a little work, cinema. Okay, we're back. We are cinema bound. It is now half five on the button, so 25 past six, 25 past six cinema. I have my whey and uh, frozen whey, that is, in the bag. Um, and then I'm gonna get a, a, a large Coke Zero in the cinema because, you know, dieting, bro, and all that. So yeah, I'll probably catch up before or after final meal. Depends, it's just gonna be chicken and veg again so i will catch up before that and that will probably wrap up today so yeah catch you in a bit what is the story so it is actually the morning after we went to the cinema and um, went to the cinema yesterday went to see where the crawdads sing a very good film it was like a thriller um it's it's a book adaptation film but very very good i would give it a solid eight out of ten uh, if you're into like a good thriller i would say it started a little bit slow but by the end it was actually it was very very good watch so we went to see that um, came back, had my last meal, it was literally just like chicken, veg, uh, and absolutely sparked out after that. I did not have the physical capacity to pick up the camera again at that stage, I just needed to go to bed. Um, so yeah, I'm going to wrap it up here, I'm just doing, going to do a bit of an outro, obviously to round off the day, you know, nothing majorly exciting really had happened. I uh, got up this morning, did cardio. It was a slog this morning. The last like three and a half minutes, black spots, the works. Thought I was gonna legit pass out. We are officially running on empty. Uh, I won't even lie, I woke up from uh, like a 15 minute nap there. I came back, had a monster, passed out. Uh, so it's it's been a slog. It's, it's becoming more and more of a slog, but what needs to be done is being done. The body fat is definitely coming off now at this stage. Check in this morning with Ryan. Uh, visuals look good. Weight is up a bit, but we're not concerned based on obviously how visuals are moving. You know, we have to consider what is in the body at the minute in terms of drug use, etc., um, which will play into that as well, obviously. So, you know, we're not concerned about that. Obviously, as long as the visuals keep improving, we're happy. So I think I will just about wrap it up here. Uh, that is basically how the majority of my days run. You know, I, I live a very a simple life. Uh, you know, work, train, cardio, eat. That basically sums it up. And then obviously, definitely gonna make the cinema like a, a weekly thing where possible, obviously depending on, on 
what films are there to watch. But like cinemas here are just shit on the ones in Ireland. Like it's ridiculous. They're all just fully kitted out with recliner seats. Mega, mega comfortable. Um, to be honest with you, I nearly fell asleep last night in, in the cinema watching the film. But I didn't. I survived. Um, I had my frozen whey with me as well. Very, very nice. Like eating ice cream. I left it in for like a little bit longer. So it stayed more solid until I got to the cinema. Um, but it, it hit nicely and then it had a, a big Coke Zero as well. Um, but I'm definitely going to try and make that a regular thing. It's just a, a very chilled out thing to do. And obviously, you know, I have to be considerate in, in the sacrifices that Emma is making here as well. In that, you know, it's not just me making a sacrifice. Like, she is sacrificing the likes of being able to go out. And Well, obviously, she can go out with friends and things like that. But, like, we can't go out for meals and shit like that. Um, yes, we go for breakfast. I'll get a coffee. She'll get breakfast. That's fine. But it's just nice to be able to... To do something we can we can both kind of sit there and get the most out of so we'll definitely try and make that a regular thing um as i said i'd love to do it weekly but i don't know if there's actually that many good films i know there's a good few coming out um a couple of horrors things like that coming out um I'm, i love a good horror film i really do but that is going to wrap it up enough rambling um so that is a day in the life done a day and a bit in the life because it's now the next morning um but yeah hopefully you enjoyed hopefully it wasn't too boring um, you know a little bit of training footage in there as well as I said next time we will probably just do an actual training day um, or try and get a leg day and maybe Cybex Hack Squat is, is in FLF so that would be back in this weekend I'm very much looking forward to that so try and maybe have the next video as a leg day um, and we'll run you through that but yeah that's going to wrap it up so if you enjoyed do all the YouTube shit like, comment, subscribe, share all that good stuff um, and yeah I will see you in the next one